G'day guys and welcome to the show where I report on the latest in gaming news and if you end up enjoying today's video please remember to smack that like button real good and now let's jump to the first news report on today's show and it's that yesterday Rocket League was announced for the Xbox One. It will be arriving on the Xbox One in February 2016 and will include three content packs. Those include Supersonic Fury, Revenge of the Battle Cars and Chaos Run. It will also feature a pair of exclusive cars based on Gears of War and Halo, both from the Xbox series. Now this is awesome news, however a big question that was asked on Twitter by many people such as Alexandra Marie, and the question was, will the Xbox One version of Rocket League have crossplay with the PS4 or PC? And then the guys over at Psyonix through the Rocket League Twitter account did reply that the Xbox platform doesn't allow for crossplay matchmaking between other systems as a general practice across all titles on the Xbox One. So yeah, that's some pretty sad news right there. We will not see crossplay on the Xbox One version of Rocket League. Basically, if you do get Rocket League on the Xbox One, you'll only be playing with other Xbox One users. But if you already have it on the PC and PS4, you know the case that you can play cross-platform. So I can play on my PC and my friend can be on his PS4 and we can play together, which is awesome. But yeah, as I said, pretty sad news. No cross-play on the Xbox One version of Rocket League coming out in February, but it should still be a pretty damn awesome game because Rocket League is just so much fun. But anyway, now let's jump to the next gaming news report on today's show. And it's that during a PlayStation experience, Epic's new game Paragon was announced and we saw some stuff regarding the game. However, they have announced something pretty cool. The first online tests for this game will be coming very, very soon. If you don't know, Paragon will be a MOBA from Epic Game Studio. So essentially, it'll be something similar to Smite and a bunch of other games. So it's going to be a bunch of cool things mixed into one. That's what they're saying. And additionally, this game will not be coming to the Xbox One. It will be only on the PC and the PS4, which is crazy. So yeah, the sad news for the Xbox One just keeps on continuing. But anyway, we continue with our next gaming news report on today's show which is our final gaming news report on today's show. It's about Fallout 4 getting its first patch. To be specific, the first official patch for Fallout 4 has arrived on the PC. The 1.2 patch notes have been posted in the game's forums, which you guys can check out in the link down below. And it solves a lot of issues, including general memory and stability improvements, as well as a fix for crashes that are triggered when jumping in water. And if you are wondering when will the patch be coming to the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One versions, it'll be coming out later this week. Bethesda hasn't stated an exact day this week, but it should be out later this week or sometime during this week, which is awesome news right there. And hopefully you guys enjoyed all the news on today's show. But now, Gorilla Man, please hand me that question. Thanks, Gorilla Man. Okay, guys, the question is, what is one major thing you'd like to see fixed in your favorite game and why? So put your answer in the comment section down below and you could end up on the next show. But if you enjoyed today's video, please remember to smack the like button because I'm Champ Chong. My accent is Australian. Here are the answers to my previous questions.